Hello, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a dragon nest in Minecraft. So first you have to do is build three blocks up with any block. Two, three, and it needs to be um, like a like as as wide as a villager house. So it's going to be three by three. So you build your three by three area right here. Then you get wort nylium. Add it all over on the top. Then you add and some blocks all around the two left and right corners. And a purple pillar in the middle. So now you'll repeat the same thing, just with stairs going down. So you can get any block as like kind of like a guide block for when it goes down, almost like this. So we're right here. Make sure. Uh, make sure it's good. And make it all the way till it touches the ground. And repeat that on all sides. Okay, so after you got your stairs on all four sides, then just build upwards right here. Then build three blocks high and they should all look like this to make sure make sure also to fill in the gaps on the bottom now put some stairs all right here And you'll see why, just in a minute. So make sure the stairs are facing each other, like this. Now, you need to grab another stair, put it on top, and do that for all the sides. And you place them all like this. And then finally you just place a block right here. So now you have a little, um, these little pillars. So what you do is you can put a slab under it like this, or you could put a lantern under it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put lanterns all under. And then now what you got to do is now you need to get a a flower plot a f f flower pot um and a, a flower pot and a one of those nether plants the on I need to see and so you need to get a flower pot and warped roots. That's what I meant. You place all the flower pots on top. Put the warped roots inside. You got this little fancy decoration right here. So it's not complete yet. So now you need to get some more warped nylium. Build upwards until you see like the final stair and make it kind of like a stair design because it's going downwards and stop making this design once you reach the finer the final stair at the bottom of here and repeat on all four sides okay so once you got your um once you got your little stairs of of uh warped nylium then you just put some some weeping vines or no twisting vines 
on all sides. You can put, um, you're able to put a string on top if you don't want them to grow. But I'll just keep them normal for now. And make each one three blocks high. And, of course, you don't have to put it on every single block of of, ni of warped nylium because it might look weird. But I'm just going to do that for the sake of the video. You can, like, add other warped plants, too. And, of course, like, most of the times, repeat on all four sides. But that will take a while, so I guess I'll just keep it on this side for now. It looks kind of weird anyways. Okay, so I just uh, already went ahead and um, and already put the vines on all sides because I guess it doesn't really take too long. But I I didn't stack them since they since they grow pretty fast. But now what you have to do is you need to build one, two, three, four blocks out. Oh no, that's too many blocks out. Okay, and then now what you have to do is get your proper pillars. Place it all along here. Uh, make sure it doesn't go up like that. And then you just repeat it on all four sides. Okay, so after you went and placed all these little mini bridges on all the sides, then get a bucket of lava and just make like little indents all around the edges like this because you're gonna create a little lava pool and it's gonna be all around here and just and just keep making indents until um until you've already made it on all the sides and don't make the lava pool, like, wrap around here because then you can't, like, get across this bridge. So make sure you don't do that. So after you went ahead and placed, um, after you had and made all the indents around, then you can go ahead and place your lava in here. Like, but if you have mods to make, like, soul lot lava, I think that would fit in more. Um, I hope Mojang actually adds soul lava, because that would be pretty cool. But, you need to make this all around the sides. This process is pretty fast if you're in creative mode like me. But just, yeah, I'm already all around the sides. And here's the lava thing. So, your build is almost complete. You just need to add a couple of finishing touches. So, then you just need to have a end rod. Let me just search for it. And place it on top of here, all along the sides. You may need to break some of the these vines because they might be in the way just make them a little shorter make sure they're all around here and then what you need to do next is you need to get um amethyst cluster and place one all around here. Oops. And then now you need to get some of uh, some of those warped grass blocks. Let me see. I'm just gonna get them real quick. So after you have your nether sprouts and and warped roots, you place one on the side one here and after you've done all of that for the very final step you just need to get 
your dragon egg, place it right in the middle, and that is how you make a dragon nest in Minecraft. Bye.